one over there. That's from Milda Vane. Apparently she's trying to smuggle you a love potion. Really? Hey, she's only interested in you because she thinks you're the chosen one. But I am the chosen one. OK, sorry. Um, kidding. All right, uh, the latest Harry Potter movie has uh, some scary moments. It also has some funny ones as well. We have Ryan Painter here within Utah this week to give us the official critique of this latest movie. Yeah, I don't know if official is, but yes. Uh, well, that's what we're calling okay. it. But. All right. Uh, I, I should go into saying I am a huge Harry Potter fan. Mm -hmm. uh, I got addicted to it early on. So from that point of view, I was surprised by this film in that I was expecting something a lot more darker than it actually was. Oh. Uh, they they do a lot with the comedy uh, of the coming of age sort of sort of thing that, that they pull off extremely well. Um, but when it comes time to be a little more dramatic and more epic in scope, they kind of miss the point. Uh, it's not nearly as emotionally engaging as I expected it to be. Um, and so in a way, it's a better film than the last one, but at the same time, it's less satisfying, if that makes sense. Mm -hmm. um, I think that most people will enjoy it. I think diehard fans will be a little frustrated with the ending. Um, this. The way that Warner Brothers has treated this is kind of a, a building up to the next couple the films that they're finishing off the series with, and so they kind there of... There a couple more, just one more. Well, there's one more book, but they're doing two films for the last book, which is, oh. a lot of us think they probably should have been doing for most of the films that they've been doing since the first or second, but, mm -hmm. uh, so that this one really feels anticlimactic in, in that sense. Really? So, overall, would you say you're... Disappointed then? I slightly disappointed. I, you know, I've only seen the film once. I do need to see it again because, unfortunately, with the Harry Potter films, a lot of times you go in saying, okay, what are they cutting out? And so you kind of get distracted by everything they take out of it um, to streamline it. Um, so I, I think most people will like the film. I just expected it to be a step above what it is. Hmm. So, but, but highly recommended. Highly obviously. recommended. Oh, yeah. I mean, I think everyone will enjoy it. I think you will have issues. But I, again, uh, I think most people will have a, a pretty good time with it. All right. Uh, who is your favorite character? My favorite character. You know, it's it's uh, over. I, part, you know, you want to identify with Harry, obviously, uh, because of the situation he's in and, and being kind of a hero character. But it, really, Hermione to me is kind of developed as a, a surprise as an actress as well as a character. Uh, I think the way that, the, that she's like been portrayed in the films is very nice. The way that she's kind of grown up from this awkward person to actually someone who's very beautiful. Um, and I think for kids to see that, it's wonderful. Mm -hmm. Now, you're, you're a big fan of Harry Potter and yes. everything. Uh, so did you dress up when you went? And well, are you, you going to go out and look for Harry Potter rocks this weekend and, uh, and that kind of thing? Well, you know, the, the irony being I have dressed up before. This was, this was the first, because as a critic, I didn't dress up for the critic screenings, which I think would have been a little more... Uh, okay, I would have I would have been really been made fun of at that point, and, and well deserved. But this was the first one that I didn't see at a midnight screening. Um, you know, all the other because I right. got to see it beforehand. Um, yeah. But uh, I might dress up at some point. You never know. Um, okay. I, yeah. <laughs> Just give us the names of the other movies coming out, but you can't say anything about it. Uh, yeah, out of time. Food Inc., fantastic documentary, and a foreign film called Revenge or Revanche. 10, uh, that was for up for Academy Award. Both are really quite good. Products. All right. Well, Ryan, thank you very much for being with us. So there you have it, the official review yes. of Harry Potter. Okay. Thanks a lot, Ron. All right. Lindsay.